Hey guys, Jan here in the North Model Shop with a not quite Sunday night gossip video. Let's try this again for probably the 200th time. Um, some of you guys seen we uploaded a video. Uh, it was uh, live, <laughs> live from the uh, the Northview Model truck at the campsite we were at. And um, when I loaded or rendered this video Sunday night, um, it ended up being about 13 minutes long. I think it was kind of long, but I said screw it, we'll go with it. Um, as soon as we got home here, we were back in Wi-Fi, upload, wouldn't let me upload, wouldn't upload, so I edited it out, got her down to 15 minutes, or 5 minutes, sorry, but when it edited, it, it kind of did, it uh, It didn't, uh, it didn't uh, cut the audio, I would left the audio in, and then there was audio overlaying it, and I didn't realize it until I got about 20 views, so, eh, whatever, delete. Um, just try this again. So here we are, and I just tried ripping this video, and my phone started going crazy with work-related stuff, I had to stop and deal with that. Anywho, um, great weekend at the model show. I don't want to get too in depth in the model show in this video. We'll do that in a separate. Um, we had a great time. Kids enjoyed it. Everyone did well. Uh, met with some friends, seen some new products and stuff. That was cool. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Leading up to the model show, we did quite a few videos here for a little bit. We were hammering them out quickly and getting great results. And then we had to kind of put the, the hold on her because we were. We were hammering trying to get models done, so it was kind of cool though. We did get one, finally, a one complete model that we were happy with. Um, the Cougar, we'll do a video on that. The uh, Kenworth, that hit a moose. Um, I don't think it turned out great, but everyone else is saying, you know, it's, it looks great, happy. Some uh, some really tough critics said it looked decent. It did well at the show. I wasn't expecting to get anything for it, but it did, it did decent, so that was cool. So um, we'll do a video on that, obviously, if I didn't already say that. But... Um, that's where we're at. So now we're gun ho you know, we went to did that uh, that show and, and hung out with people and won some door prizes and bought some new products. So now we're excited. Got the bug. Just itching to get back at the bench. So we'll do this video here and get ready to add her. Um, trying to think here. Um, you know, it is what it is, right? It's been a tired, tired. Everyone's tired. Three days camping with kids is difficult. Throw a model show and... Uh, and I think it's a boat, give or take, 600 clicks each way. I think the trailer odometer on a truck there counts the trailer mileage. I think it was close to 1,200 kilometers round trip. So a lot of driving. Um, I've gotten better last year. I had to switch with the wife four or five times around driving because I got tired. So this time I was able to do the whole trip myself. So yeah, it was, it was all right. Kept ourselves entertained, so not too bad. Um, rained too, right? Driving home in the rain was pretty bad, but... We were all gone home to take the bike to the model show too, right? And I went to um, I went through the tank. Uh, as you guys, if you remember or not, the tank was a different color, so we were going to clean that up. And there were some runs in it, so I threw it in the uh, the purple pond, and it didn't quite. The purple pond wouldn't eat that L clad off, so I threw it into the brake fluid, and uh, got into other things and some weathering and some airbrushing and stuff like that here, and then forgot all about it the night before. So I'm like, well, I don't got time to, you know, sand and clean and prime and paint and paint and get it back together and everything so we will um we'll put that back in the shelf and we'll work on that one and we'll take it to cams next year that's the last show it's eligible for so we'll do that um but besides that you know it's uh, it was a good show like i said this video is kind of going to be a little uh, we're all tired today um wayne osborne um guys check him out he's another one of us canadians canucks hoser um He's building, I forget what it is now, but it's a, it's, I think it's like a European thing now. It's a car. Really cool looking thing. It's really, it looks like it might be a very difficult kit to work with. And what he's trying to do with it, I think he's even making it more difficult. But what he's going to end up, when the end product is just going to be like top notch, amazingly cool. Um, and he's ended up pulling out all the stops on this one. He actually, from a watch the video, he was torn around body shops trying to find someone that can mix and match the, with the color to get it to the actual factory color from these things which is I guess almost very difficult to do and he's going to build the ha hammer it out by the looks of it so I'm, I'm excited I'm following him along pretty close um, my old buddy Jonathan Milberry I've seen on a few comments he posted on one of my videos there from last week he's building so that's exciting very very exciting um, what else in there um, following through um instagram and facebook if you guys aren't already clearly scales and we still owe them one more video for their uh, their ford camera motor we bought we got to get that underway too he's a uh, hammer out some really cool freaking stuff the uh, 
a lot of buzz on that I've been talking to you guys uh, who like the imports and stuff for like that. A lot of buzz around that Volkswagen motor they have, so that's cool. And then the guy turns around and fires out a, an accessory kit to go with it. I think it turbos the kit and stuff like that. So that's really, really friggin' cool. Um, guys, and we should have big news uh, regarding Clearly Scales here in the next couple weeks, I hope. So we'll, we'll blow that up for you guys as well. Uh, I'm talking Clear Scales. I don't know if he's going to go on this, but if you guys follow Clearly Scale or anything, tell him you want to see it. He, uh, for a buddy, just as a uh, joke or as a favor, he um, resin casts from a, a die cast, a, um, a jet ski and trailer. And uh, I hope he turns around and pops these things out because this looks absolutely super cool. So that would be cool. I Hopefully he does that. Um... I think here we won't drag on too long um, this coming week here in the model shop Northview model shop um, we're starting with another build we should be starting with that build and probably uh, I shouldn't do it but I'll probably start another one on top of that I really should be finishing that uh, that German Panzer bricklayer the bridge layer kit I should get that finished before I start anything major big but that brick uh, or that um, Bridge layer is an ongoing uh, project that'll go for quite a while because it's a very intense, very big kit, and we're really enjoying it. So we'll uh, we'll plot along with that. But um, anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. If you like what you're seeing, remember always hit thumbs up if you love it, and if you really, really, really like this stuff, share it. Share it like you wouldn't believe. We really appreciate when that those when you guys do that for us. If you're not grooving, us, give it a thumb down. We understand it's not what you're grooving, and uh, we'll try to tailor our content to better suit your needs. All right, guys. Adios.